Second time this week, you're going to have problems if you take the Duquesne Incline. It is closed again because of bed bugs. Latest closure coming after viewers contacted us and Brenda Waters went with them as they took their concerns to the Incline's manager. Lindsay Ward picks up coverage of our story right now with more on the action being taken. Well, it certainly has been a rough week for the Duquesne Incline as bugs, bed bugs, have been found inside of their incline cars several times this week, and they decided to close today. I want you to take a look at the sign that is now posted on the front door. The Duquesne incline is closed until 5.30 tomorrow morning is when it will be up and running. So the Port Authority, which actually owns the incline, will once again have exterminators coming in, treating the cars, as well as the station area. The bed bugs were discovered on the incline Wednesday, prompting workers there to close in the afternoon. Now, it was just a couple of days ago when the cars were treated for an infestation of the bugs. One rider claims that she was actually bitten more than 100 times. And just yesterday, another rider tells KDKA while she was on the incline, she could actually see the bugs. We all stood up, six of us on the car, and we're all looking around, and then out they come between the slats in the bench. Now, to help out riders who typically take the incline, the Port Authority has offered a shuttle for those riders. They will be from the upper station on Grandview Avenue to the lower station on the West Carson Street. People have already been picked up this morning. The incline is typically up and running around 5:30 this morning, and it won't reopen until 5:30 tomorrow morning. Reporting live this morning, Lindsay Ward, KDKA News.